Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Please, if today is your first time of stopping by here, please don't go without subscribing. Please subscribe. Subscribe, it's very important to me. And if you have been here before and you have not subscribed, please try as much as possible to subscribe today. Give my video a thumbs up. And if it's possible, please help me share my video. And I won't forget to thank those that have subscribed to my YouTube channel so far. Uh, I have 800 subscribers already. Please, 200 to go. At least to get 1,000 subscribers. Please, subscribe. So today's video, I'm going to be talking about two popular baiting soap. This one, extract. Extracts uh, whitening herbal soap. I don't know if you can see it like this. Yeah, it's a very uh, popular soap, and this pure herbal papaya soap. So today we're going to be talking about the boat, which is better. And one thing before I continue, there's something I would like to correct or one impression about the soap that a lot of persons have or a lot of people believe that uh the one with this aramic uh, right up is the fake why the other one is the original no it's not the fake this is the nigeria made and is as good as the one made in the philippine philippine owned this product originally if i'm not mistaken the franchise was given to Nigeria, a Nigeria company that also produced this basically for our black skin or our kind of skin. So it's not fake. There might be fake even uh, in the Philippines. They can still be fake here. As in this one, this brand can also have fake. But the fact that uh, Aramic is written on it or it is written made in Nigeria does not make it fake. That is the impression I want to correct today. So now let's go over to the soap. How good is this soap? You know, there's a lot of hype about the soap. Some says uh, the furry one is better. Uh, why the Nigerian one is not good? To me, I haven't used the... Uh, the one made in the Philippines before. I have someone, a friend, who is using that one and her skin is very, very fine. It's like the soap has really lightened her skin, even help her clear up some dark spots and all of that. Me personally, I've not used that. But this made in Nigeria, because I didn't know the difference before. I just uh, got this. Initially, I wanted the furry one, but because this was the one I was able to get, so I started using it. This is, I just cut it. This is the half part remaining, so so I can just try it. Because the hype about the soap is much, and me, I cannot be left out. <laughs> so I said, okay, let me try it. So far, so good. The soap is nice. This soap is very, very lovely. The hype. Is not for no, it's not just uh, because they want to hype. The soap is really, really good. When I say really good, there's this smoothness that it gives to the skin immediately after a bit. And I also noticed that this soap kind of exfoliates the skin because I left my skin for like two weeks without exfoliating at all. Then I use the soap. After using the soap, I noticed that it really did exfoliate my skin. I was seeing dead skin cells falling out of my skin. So then I, I now believe that this soap is really, really nice. So like I always say, if you are thinking of getting this soap, you can get it. It's lovely. You will like the outcome. Be it the Nigeria, be it the one made in the Philippines, they are both nice. So it all depends on what you want. If you can, if it's the made in Nigeria that you got, fine. If it's the one made in the Philippines, fine. 
they are both very very nice so don't let anybody deceive you that the one made in nigeria is the fake no it's not the fake now over to this one pure haba papaya soap this one is a uh, it's also a very popular soap this i use this particular one around uh 2017 although then i didn't know if the soap really had effect on me and i was not using something that is very uh i, I was not using lightning cream that i would say oh maybe it's the cream that i was using that made me lighter i didn't even know that this soap is as good as how i wanted it to be i was just using i said ah, let me use it. after all it, it contained papaya and those days i don't even believe that soap work i don't believe that soap have any effect i just believe it's just for you to wash that away from your body but from the little i can remember about this soap i remember that i was very light when i was using the soap and apart from my own personal experience i also have a very close friend who stays very close to me here in nigeria that is using this soap and her skin is effortlessly fine and light she used the soap and used uh vit gold oil that's what she used and she is bright she's fine and her skin is very very beautiful so if you ask me extract and pure haba papaya which is better I'll tell you that they are both nice but personally i would go for extract maybe because of the fact that it's kind of uh exfoliate the skin which i never noticed about this i didn't notice any exfoliating effects when i was using this so but when it comes to lightening this soap the both they lighten the skin very very well and this one clears dark spot because uh me like what i said previously concerning the supplement that gave me uh acne and the rest so after uh the acne started drying off which i also had to use another supplement to control that acne of which i'll talk about some other time the supplements that i'm using i want to use it to some reasonable extent before i can confirm that yes this is the supplement that really worked for my acne so then i started using this extra and i kept my liquid soap for some time i started using this i noticed that it was brightening the dark spot on my face although it's not completely gone yet but i still believe that it will go for now i'm just using this as my face soap and it's working perfectly well so if you are thinking of getting any of this product they are both nice but remember if you want your product whatever product that you are using to work for you if you want your product to work for you perfectly you know what to do you know what i want to see already try as much as possible to exfoliate your skin because if you don't exfoliate, it will be as if you are just wasting your time and energy. It won't give you what you want. So, I think that will be all about this video today. Like I said before, please, if this is your first time here, please don't go without subscribing. I want to get to 1,000 subscribers. Please, please, people should give me 1,000 subscribers. And I can't thank the 800 subscribers. In fact, I can't thank you enough. You people have really done well. You have really progressed my ministry. So please get it to 1,000 subscribers so it will be complete. My name is Tracy Lawrence. And right now, I'm signing out. See you in my next video.